Hello, so as you can see, a lot of time when we work on the computer, um, can you do one that with your arm in front of you, imagine you are typing the computer? Yeah, so notice how our shoulder run forward and our elbow kind of relax. And the head, it can be go tail up or look down as you, you know, do whatever you do. So a lot of time when we come to yoga, this part, it turns to tension and the front body feel weakness. So I'd like you to go ahead to start bringing your awareness to the lower back. So bringing yourself upright, feel that the extension from your lower back, feel your mean back and to the back, the top of your head. But again, our head is heavy, right? And often beyond your shoulder. So can you lean forward, your head forward? Yeah, so notice how our head is over our shoulder. So I like you to bring your gaze level, look straight ahead. And use the one hand to press the back of your head. Oscar? Yeah. So you are not tilt your head or lower your chin down. You push the back of your head straight into your own hand. So don't look down, look straight and push your hand, your head into your hand straight, okay? While you relax the shoulder. And just feel how you feel in this position. So a lot of time when we are feeling lower back pain or tension in around the shoulder, um, many people talk about changing their chair or get a new desk, but actually what we need to um, change is actually bring our awareness back to our body and correct ourselves. Make sure that our internal structure of the spine always protect by you. So from your neck down to your shoulder and down to your spine all the way to the tailbone. That's your internal structure of your body. Then you can consider bring your table up or put something like a block, label up your, your computer and have always have something behind your back to make sure your back is back. Not always keep leaning forward and keep leaning forward <laughs> or bring your phone with you. Imagine you are looking at your own phone. Yeah, and how long that how many hours that we do that every day. So this would be a good home practice and self-awareness. And if you can maintain this awareness on a daily basis, the more likely when you come into meditation or yoga, you will have a better posture to begin with. So thank you, Oscar. <laughs>